Hello beautiful people, I am Karim and welcome back to my channel called Smell of Truth. Today you will see the truth before you buy. Azzaro the most wanted. So, I ordered this, I blind bought this, uh, you will see my first impression after the intro and then we go with the truth before you buy this year I stay the same dude always the main dude yeah I stay the same dude always the main today we will talk about the newest Azzaro flanker and you see my first impression of it but first we need to change the color in the background that's better isn't it so based on what i've heard i saw already some videos on youtube about that and i heard that it is probably nothing special but still a good release we will see so okay Here you see the bottle. Oh wow, okay, so this is a grey gourmet fragrance. This reminds me a bit of Pure Haven. Well, actually of the Muggler DNA. The, the cocoa from the Muggler DNA, I can see that in here. I can smell that in here, kind of. It is not bad. The opening was very kind of cocoa, kind of chocolatey. Yeah, the opening was kind of chocolatey. Now that it goes down, that it dries a bit down, it is smoother. It's just sweet and gives me a bit of gives me a bit of caramel vibe, I would say. Yeah, but um, honestly, this is not bad. Is it better than Wonder by Night so far? Hmm, let's see. Um, the thing with Wonder by Night is that Wonder by Night is versatile. You can wear this every season, every time. Maybe not in high heat, but you could still rock it in summer when it's a bit colder, you know, and you still want to smell sweet in summer. Uh, I, would, I would say that will go easy, in my opinion, as always. I just don't like wearing sweet fragrances in summer or in the high heat. I honestly get a bit of the Stronger With You, the original, get a hint of that vibe, of that DNA. It goes in a similar direction, I would say, because it has also some something synthetic, something that gives me a headache, with the original the original Empori Armani Stronger With You gives me a little, gives me a headache when I smell it. Just the first sniff was like really, I had a massive headache, so I had to get used to the fragrance. First I didn't like it, then I liked yeah, it. Yeah, it gives me that kind of vibe. Okay, so what I can definitely tell you that this one, it's... I'm not saying that this is boring, but honestly, I like it. But still, I think that uh, there is already something similar on the market. It's not, uh, it's not a clone of it, but they are just very similar. Stronger with you intensely by Empori Armani. So this one is just kind of they share similar notes that's why i say that they smell similar this one is darker this one is darker and it's a bit spicier i would say this one is more sweet and kind of creamy and doesn't have this kind of darkness that azaro the most wanted has so if you want so if you liked this one but you think that you would like something that is kind of more dark. Go with this one. Just consider that stronger with you intensely lasts longer. 
you will see the main notes for this one right here on the right side and when we already talk about longevity this one here lasts around seven to eight hours so not bad but also not really mind-blowing in my opinion the best flanger is still Azzaro Wanted by Night. This one is great, it's versatile and it's simply just the better scent in my opinion. Even if I first didn't like this, uh, I like this from the first time that I've smelled it. It was not bad but like I said it's also not mind-blowing, it's nothing new, it's simply just a dark kind of it's simply just a dark toffee fragrance. It's okay, it's nice, not bad. And if you find this for a good price, you can definitely go for it. So if you find this one cheaper than Stronger With You Intensely, I will go with this one. Even if the Stronger With You Intensely lasts around two hours longer. Siage on this one is good, is moderate, not beast mode or something like that but it's pretty good it's not a it's not really a skin scent like it's near to you it kind of pushes a bit out but also not too much and you definitely if you spray a bit more this is not really a fragrance that this is a fragrance that in my opinion you have to spray a little bit more to have a better projection and a better sillage so i would recommend you seven to ten sprays with this one depends on where you go but yeah this here doesn't really share some similarities to to the original wanted or to wanted by night only maybe a hint a hint a hint of mandarin orange is what you could get at the top note. That was the truth before you buy. Uh, yeah, if you f if you find this for a great deal, I will go for it. But I think that the stronger with you intensely would be the better fragrance, even though this is kind of darker. <laughs> Why did I do that? Okay, let's do that thumbnail. Thank you very much for watching, subscribe to my channel to not miss out on any great content anymore and leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching and of course to support my channel. Stay healthy and see you next time, bye!